getting ready to build a small deck and a ramp coming off here. The ramp is actually going to be uh, six feet, six by five, and then the, that's the deck six by five, and the ramp is going to be uh, probably about four feet wide. So you see right here, I'm going to tear that down. I got all my wood over there on the trailer. I'm going to pick this up, get all my tools, and get ready to get started. And if you want to be a something like this, I'm going to send you, uh, I give you the measurements and everything, all the wood you need, and probably actually pretty much the cost, okay? All right? Till then, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to we'll get rid of these steps right here. So you see I already moved that. So we're going to move those steps back, and then we're going to build our frame. All right, so now you can see we got the frame up. On our way, we're gonna get ready to do now is put the joists in. We go and uh, after we put the joists in, then we're gonna put the rails on there. And then we'll start with the bottom. All right, so I've been out here working on this for probably about maybe six hours now. And so now you can see behind me exactly what most of it looks like now. I got that portion of it done. That is actually a six by five little porch or you want to call it a little deck whatever you want to call it and I'm going to have the opening right here it's going to be a four, uh, four foot opening and this is where the the ramp is going to come down so tomorrow I'm going to do the part two we finish the ramp and that should take care of it uh, so we'll finish up with it tomorrow and I'll show you guys all of it all right hey hey so we're back at it today so what we're going to do now is I'm getting ready to add the ramp onto it when I finish the ramp then, we should be good. Now the ramp is gonna be right at about seven feet long. So we're gonna make that. And we got a little small angle. You wanna see here. So I got that cut. I got my angle cut here. Alright. I'm just gonna put it up against that. Alright, so we're gonna get to work on this. When I finish, I'll zoom it in, let you check it out. All right, so check it out. We got the frame, put the ramp built right there. It's coming down. We are moving. So now what we're going to do is get ready to put the three-quarter inch plywood on top of it. We'll cut it, and then we'll be ready for the rails. Okay. Hey, so now what we did was I put those rails right there in the inside. Side it up. So what the wheels of the wheelchair won't actually run on, out on the side of it. So. Next, what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and start putting those rails in. I'm going to video that one so you can actually see. I made a little tube to actually accommodate me on getting everything right. So you measure it, make your little tube into using that, and everything should pan out okay. All right? All right, so I'm going to go ahead now and put the rail on there. I put that on there, and then I come back and we're going to video the other top portion of what I'm going to do and also the rail so you can see that. All right? Hey, so if you guys want to learn how to put, actually put a rail, line these rails up on here like that. And what I did is I actually made my own little tool. I'll show you my little tool, right? So this right here is going to help line up my rail. And I'm going to show you what that does. I actually put a block in the top up there. That block is about two, a little bit over two and a half inches in there to hold the top. And I actually put a screw right there in the bottom to where it could just sit right on top of it. Okay. And then I got also a block at the bottom to hold that. That's actually actually the measurement of a two by four. I'll show you what that looks like. Come on, let's go over here. I'll show you this. Yeah, buddy. Man, this thing worked out pretty doggone good. All right. So let me squeeze it here. What you see, this is my tool. I already got this one where it real lined up the way this works is this fits in the top and you see that bottom it fits down there right so i put this in push it up against that all right like so and push down on the wheel a little bit and lock it in because i got my screw sticking out at the very top you see that screw i got it sticking out just a little bit down there so it catches that bottom, works out wonderful. And down at the bottom, see that? So now, I'm actually ready. I'm on the opposite side. Rough. 
and now I'm ready. All I have to do is take this. You can see. Take this one. Push it up against that. I push it up against it like this. Boom. And that works. I'm gonna show you at a different angle. Now you can see it. See how that lines up? All the way at the bottom. That's the bottom. And that is the top. Boom. That's my tool. I call it the liner upper. <laughs> For real. Cool, right? Yep. That's my layer line. My my tail liner. Alright, so I'm gonna go all the way down and finish this right here. That's exactly how I did that side. Boom. Just like that. So this side, I'm gonna go down it the same exact way. Finish that real quick and I'll be back. So this is how this tool worked. This is my little tool. I'm gonna take this that I made and you fit it in. It goes on top. It locks down at the bottom. And you see it spaces between the two. If I put it right here where I was using it, put it in. And it fits right in there. Once you space those two, you take this out and you move it over. And you space it. Place it on the next one. Two fits in there good. You see where the screw is on top. You see where that my space right here. And then at the bottom. Got that. And it also spaces my two by four. And you see right here, that's the spacer in between that and at the top. And you take the next board and you're going to place it right up against it, right? And push it. And make sure those two are all the way up against that. And you put it where you need it and screw it down. Just that simple. Right. So we finally finished up, so. So here it is. I got the no stick tape on there. Well, uh, no slip tape on there, rather. Uh, we actually ended up, I'm gonna show you, turn this around. So we got the no slip tape on there, as you see. Okay. Uh, we put the, I put some handles on here for her to pull up on. That's gonna assist her on getting up there. I finished the rails on this side and the rails on that side. And this is right here, we put the guards here for the wheelchair. Right here. All right. And that is pretty much it. Took a little time, put some hours in it. But I got it done. Always remember, you can do anything you want to do. If you what? Just put your mind to it. Yep. So I'm done. Other than that, another project in the bank. We will see you guys later. Hey, you have fun building stuff. This is Jay May. We'll see you.